Hi, welcome to my channel and learn artificial intelligence with me. I am Saida. I learn and teach data science and I'm also the co-founder of the School of AI Brussels. Today we are going to talk about the four main types of artificial intelligence. We are going to look first at the KD Nuggets website, which defines classical artificial intelligence as follows. Classical artificial intelligence are algorithms and approaches, including rules-based systems. Again, the same website, KD Nuggets, explains narrow artificial intelligence. Narrow artificial intelligence, the field of artificial intelligence where the machine is designed to perform a single task and the machine gets very good at performing that particular task. However, once the machine is trained, it does not generalize to unseen domains. This is the form of artificial intelligence that we have today. For example, Google Translate. And now we are going to look simply learn website for the definition of artificial general intelligence, AGI. General artificial intelligence or artificial general intelligence, also known as strong artificial intelligence, can understand and learn any intellectual task that a human being can. It allows a machine to, to apply knowledge and skills in different contexts. Artificial intelligence researchers have not been able to achieve strong artificial intelligence so far. They would need to find a method to make machines conscious, programming a full cognitive ability set. Again, KD Nuggets website goes in detail to define artificial general intelligence AGI. Artificial general intelligence AGI, a form of artificial intelligence that can accomplish any intellectual task that a human being can do. It's more conscious and makes decision similar to the way humans make decision. And now what is super intelligence? Let's go back to the Simply Learn website. Super artificial intelligence surpasses human intelligence and can perform any task better than a human. The concept of artificial superintelligence sees artificial intelligence evolve it to be so akin to human sentiments and experiences that it does not merely understand them. It also evokes emotions, needs, beliefs, and desires of its own. Don't forget to subscribe and learn artificial intelligence with me as we are going to talk about more artificial intelligence to our next videos.